हेलो ऑल एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज चंद्रमणि पांडे एंड थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वाचिंग माय अदर वीडियोस आई एम होपिंग दैट माय वीडियोस आर एडिंग सम वैल्यूज इन योर डे टू डे इन ट्यून ऑपरेशन वर्क प्लीज कंसीडर सब्सक्राइबिंग माय चैनल बाय सब्सक्राइबिंग यू विल गेट एक्सेस टू न्यू वीडियोज एज सुन एज दे आर अपलोडेड एंड इट्स अ ग्रेट वे टू स्टे अप टू डेट विद माई कंटेंट एंड सपोर्ट मी एट द सेम टाइम Let's see how we can register a device in Windows Auto Pass service. So before registering the device in Windows Auto Pass service, let me show you that in my Windows Auto Pass service under devices and we can see that we do not have any device showing under ready state. So to register a device in Windows Auto Pass service, we have to add a device in Azure Active Directory group called Windows Auto Pass device registration. Now I am going to add a device in Windows Auto Pass service. To do this, we have to go to the groups, and under all groups, we have to search a group called Windows Auto Pass Device Registration Group, and then we have to add a member in this group. So we can add a device in Windows Auto Pass Device Registration Group in many ways. The first way is to use a bulk operation method. Second way is use add membership. And here we can search for a specific machine and add that machine, or we can also add already existing group in this group. So now I am using manual method to add test devices in this group. So to do this, I am going to search for my test PC, and then I am going to select all the machines which I want to add in this group. For now, I have selected test PC one, two, three, and four, and I am going to click on select. and then we have to wait for operation to complete now we can see that group membership successfully added four member were added and we have to refresh it now we can see that all the test devices are successfully added in the windows auto pass device registration group now we have to go to the devices again and under windows auto patch we have to go to devices and now we can see that devices are not showing in ready state the instruction clearly says that it can take up to an hour for registered device to be appear here if you want we can run a discover device action and then click on okay we have to wait for some time to show those devices under ready not ready or not registered state to take further actions now we can see that after some time test pc 1 2 and 3 is showing under ready state with the status of active and uh, and test pc4 is showing as not registered and if you want to know the reason why machine is not registered in uh, auto pass service we have to click on that machine and it's going to show the detailed information and if you want to enroll test pc4 in windows auto pass service we have to first fix these issues i hope this is an informative video for you thank you very much for watching this video